It's a good thing to be alive and we are grateful to God for the first of November. Welcome to Niyamunda TV and today we have a very beautiful design to recreate and this is coming from Mala Creative. You can follow him up on IG and get inspiration from his design. He's a great guy. Mala Creative. We celebrate you. Alright, so this design is from Mala Creative. I want to recreate it. I'm going to be showing you exactly how you two can recreate it with that stress using your smartphone so without further ado let's jump right into it the first thing we want to do here is to get our background which i already have here so you just to add your background once you add your background this is what you're going to get once you get something like this we're going to still use some other tools here so let me show you the tools we're going to use so this is one of the tools i'm going to be using it's called a lens flare or you call it a lighting effect or whatever you want to call it do it to like this video and subscribe to my youtube channel so that you can see more of it if you don't subscribe and like maybe you're not going to see this channel again but i want you to see it so, so subscribe and turn on notification so this is it i'm going to keep it because i'm going to be using it now the structure of this design is that there are there are like, let me bring it so that you've seen it let me bring the design so if you look at the design, there are several images here, about yes, yeah, seven of them forming the main and the one at the top. So what we're going to do is just to bring them in. So so basically, we're going to divide this guy into parts. You can see the parts here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And how did I do that? Click here, click here. Because it's seven, you can put six here put this like this going to be divided into seven like this right the size for this design this is it this is the size all right so let's go jump right into the video so what we need to do is to get images that we can fix into those parts so let's look for images that can work so i have this one here all right so just do like this all right Use it bring it here then when you are done like this then you come here and click on crop so with crop you cannot focus on the part that you want to um collect so let's say to where this nose is then you can still bring it here so all right so okay, we are done so all you need to do is to drag it so to so drag it like this till it fits into the line right it's still looking this one is looking big so let us make it small and how do we do that we can reduce it like this and drag this here that means we can drag this all right we can drag this and then we can bring this like this here get that now then we can come here and click on um shadow and just make it make sure that it's white all right so that is done so don't worry about the coloring yet just leave it like this then we can come here so i can go to the top all right then we can bring the hollow ones are you seeing that now so let's say um this one Okay, let's say this one for example just bring it here focusing on the face then we can crop it rubbing it we have to focus on here and yeah right so we just come here and we'll put it there okay Let's go again. Let's push this like this. Let's scrub it like this. See this whole half. Put it there. You can send it to the back so that you can bring this one to the front like this. Right? Then we can come here and then we'll click on this and make sure that the shadow is enabled. Make sure that the shadow is white. Alright? Then we can come again and we'll bring this one here. 
so that's how we had all the images so just focus on the face like this then come here and then click on crop and you're cropping you're focusing on only the face just a part of the face towards where the two eyes start and end so somewhere there then you're dragging it like this so that the face will become a little bit bigger and then you put it position it there then you bring this one to the front then bring this last one to the front so this is what we have like this then you can come here you can you can yes i think that is not bad so let's come again let's bring in the other one all right so let's say this one for example this one then reduce put it there all right then come here crop it all right then just focus here all right it's, it has it has been looking one side or just one side so why not we try to bring it the other side so let's focus on here like this like this like this all right so that's the that that they can increase it I can fix it there all right okay so this one should be very very accurate all right then we would can come here um don't forget to like the video if you want to learn how i got the background and every other thing there is a course that I can, i'm going to give to you if you're interested so this one is the next this one is the next so click here i right, don't worry we'll soon be done like the video and share it to a friend subscribe to my youtube channel for more tutorials like this so that's that so you bring it here all right so you're feel you're feeling it here like this all right then let us all right so that's not bad increase it a little make sure that it's on the line then make sure that the shadow is turned on the shadow is white selected then you can okay that's fine then let's bring in the last two which is this one here and this one here no no i've used this we've used this so let's bring in which one is left i think we've not used this so we'll just do this like this then we'll come here and we'll crop it let's focus on the face just the face okay all right then we'll bring it here we we'll increase it increase it all right then we can bring it here Can still touch it a little. All right. Reduce it small. All right. So this is it. Put it here. Increase it one more time. Okay. All right. Then come here. Which one is remaining? One, two, three, four, five. All right. So let's look for one okay this one is not there yet click on crop please like the video and subscribe to my youtube channel for more tutorials like this then i'm going to come here i'm going to not rotate i'm going to flip it All right remember i'll target it just the face facial expression especially that smile so let's put this one here like this all right then we'll come here you can click on this like the video and share it tell me where you're watching from all right so i'm done now that now that we're done like this the next thing we want to do is to get this this blend you can blend it so so we're going to bring we're going to bring going to blend the whole thing and how we're going to do that i'm going to show you how so we'll, we'll bring this background to the front that is the background this background all right then we're going to blend it how do we do that so look we're going to come here i'm going to remove the part that we don't want 
so assuming that okay i don't want these parts all right i don't want all these parts don't worry about this we're going to fix them so i don't want all these parts all right i don't want all these parts all right so so if i do it like that this is what i'm going to get if you get this we can work on it and how do you do that so let's come first to the background again let us work on the this all right then let's also use this guy that is this this light effect here let's use it to work on everything here so we can come here select this come here select this so let's start with this color that is coming here it's like a white all right so around this part i'm going to put that color there all right then if you check the corner all right so let's leave that one there we check the corners around this part here you will see that dark color so this color here you're going to see it so select that color all right something like that okay then if you check this other side you will see there is a different color there somewhere here all right so let's come here let's select let's select this color all right then let's bring this here let's bring this here like this all right so something like that right then we can also we can also this light the light the one the first one which is this one yes yeah, this one we can increase it let's bring it to the front then increase it all right so bring it to the front then increase it so it's like it's the dominant color there all right so like that so when you are done so when you are done you want to come here and then click on this and bring this image here uh, not this one let's try the other one all right you can bring this image here okay we'll just reduce it and put it there all right so pastor's name is bishop david is it ibio here <laughs> so let's go david so we we'll just look for a script font one that is actually very scripting <laughs> so we'll come over here we'll look for a script font let's look for something that we can use let's see this or this or this yes, i think this one is not so bad so let's try this so we'll just come here we'll change the color to maybe black all right something like that and then we'll just increase the boldness let's just make it bold so make sure that you click on padding to make sure that everything is completely out then you can reduce it you can reduce it there you can put it very close to him then we can come here we can include the other name here I B E B O Z O B O E E B E B E M E. Alright, so something like that. Then you can come here and put it there. Alright, then the, the there's another word that we can add here. So just watch what we're going to do now. So here we say we can say thank you for answering the call all right i just come here you can change the font to this guy right i just fix it there reduce it and then increase this the spacing not too much all right then you can come here and then centralize it 
so we can also come here copy this one so right here we're going to type in um do it to like this video to establish the kingdom of god if you want to learn how to create awesome designs like this and more you want to learn how to get any kind of background that you need from the internet you want to learn how to do that how to sort for backgrounds you want to learn how to manipulate photos how to edit your photos you want to learn in fact let me tell you something when you register for my church flyer design course now that course is not just about church flyer if you follow through the lesson you will be able to design any kind of flyer because i shared principles that are general and principles that are specific principles that are general to designing a flyer so if you follow through the course you'll be able to learn and design any and every kind of flyer all you need to do is to pay for that course and start learning immediately the the fee for that course is just a token just a small token and you are starting already how much is that just ten thousand there there's going to be a link in the description for you to register or you can send me a message on whatsapp and you'll be able to register so i'm done we are done so what do you do now first of all let's make it straight up just go ahead and save the design all right click here and save the design so you can see me saving the design right now so after you save the design all you need to do now is to go to snapseed snap seed so what we want to do in snap seed now is to try to edit the design to have the feel of the original design all right so let's bring in the design so the design will be added now so let's leave all those other things let's work on first let's go to looks go to tools go to image tune so right here we're going to tune the image all right so first of all let's remove some colors then second of all let's come over here ambience okay let's come here right, go back to saturation and increase this come over here all right so this is where we'll do the magic so yeah it's all the magic so you keep adjusting until you get what you're looking for so let's try to increase this all right then let's go over here again um let's adjust all right so that's how you keep working on it until you get your result so is it all right do it to like this video subscribe to my youtube channel and tell me where you're watching from okay Thank you for watching to the end. Name is Nia Buda and I will see you in the next video. So throughout this November, always come to my YouTube channel for fresh tutorials like this. That's going to blow your mind. Thank you for watching. Get the course today. The Church Flyer Design course is going to teach you how to create awesome designs, how to get any kind of background, and many other things you're going to be learning. Check the description for a link on what you're going to learn.